Welcome to 3 Minute Thoughts. So I want to talk about juggling. First started learning juggling when I was a young teenager and I was not very good at it. I'm still not very good at it, but I think everyone should learn it because there are some benefits. I've always been a klutz and I still drop things every so often, but now I've got like that muscle memory that I'll try to immediately grab it again, which has come in handy a few times, but it also has, I also have an instinct where I'll try to throw things just randomly. So there's downsides as well. But here's a quick primer on how to juggle if you want to learn. First, you need three objects and then put two of them down. Don't touch them. Start with just one and you throw it from one hand through the air and catch it in the other hand and then throw it back. And what you're doing is you're training yourself how to throw and how to catch. And just keep doing that back and forth and back and forth until you feel comfortable with your throwing and your catching. Then it gets trickier. You add in a second ball. Now, when you're going to throw, you're also going to throw, but pay attention to when it's right here at the midpoint. When it's at the midpoint, that's when you throw the second one. So throw and then throw, and then you'll catch and catch. And start to do that again. Throw and throw and catch and catch. And once you feel comfortable doing that, then you can throw in a third ball. And this is where people get th get confused. Is when you tend to have three balls, the instinct is to start with the hand with the one ball, and then you end up throwing the two balls at the same time, and it just gets messy. Start with the hand with the more balls. Palm one inside like this, and have the other in the fingers like this. Start with the finger one first, throw that, throw that, and you throw that, and then just keep throwing. And you're juggling. And eventually things will drop and then you just start over again and keep practicing and keep practicing. And I said, I've, I started this when I was a kid and I don't actually practice that often. Maybe once a year, I'll like break out juggling balls and start trying to see if I can remember how to do stuff. And I can just remember how to do basic stuff. There's more advanced techniques. That's, that's for another video. For now, just start with the one ball and Oh, also, well, I don't have them, but like if you have a little orange or tangerine, those also work. So if you don't want to get jungle balls, just grab some oranges, three of them, and just don't do eggs. No. But start with an orange, toss the orange back and forth, and get used to the rhythm of starting with one hand and catching in another hand. It's important to clear your area of all breakables or just make sure you're far away from anything like that. And those are my thoughts. Thanks.